Hi everybody. This video is a case study on how to take an image of a character and use Midjourney to create images of that same person as a young child and as an old person. The first thing you need to do is to enable remix mode in Midjourney. Type slash settings and click on remix mode. When it's turned on, then it will be colored green. I'm also using version four of Midjourney. Remix mode allows you to modify the prompt when making a variation of an image. I started with the prompt, photograph of an ethereal woman, 24 years old, with short, wavy brown hair. That gave me a grid of four potential women. I may upscale image four in the lower right corner. I then use this version as the base for all the other images in this series. It's important to start from an image at any age and then make variations from that image and then make variations from the next image and the next image. I click the make variations button and since I have remix mode enabled, the remix modal window popped up. This is the remix prompt that allows you to modify the existing prompt however you like. For this aging process, we're going to be mostly changing the specified age in the prompt. The remix prompt will give you a four image grid. From those possibilities, I selected this image as my 30 year old character. Use the re remix prompt again with make variations, changing the prompt to 40 years old to create this image. I think she looks older than 40. Again, I made a variation of that image, changing the age to 50 years old and created this image. All you're doing is remixing the previous image and changing the specified age. And honestly, people two age significantly between 40 and 50. Here she is at 60 years old. Of course, at age 60, her hair would no longer naturally be brown, so it would be using a hair dye. And this 60 year old woman is kind of rough looking. It's been a difficult de decade for her perhaps. And now at 70. I changed the hair and age color, I mean the hair color and age in the prompt. But again, it's very important that you remix from the previous image. Do not go back to the 24 year old and attempt to change the age to 70. The results might not be what you want. Aging her now to 80 years old by making a variation on the 70 year old image and remixing the prompt. This time, however, I changed the hair from short, wavy gray hair to thin white hair. At age 80, most people's hair will be very thin. As an experiment, I remixed the image of the 80 year old into a 20 year old to see how Midjourney handled the reverse aging process. The prompt, Midjourney did a very good job. The photo itself looks like it aged 60 years. This could easily be a colorized photograph from 60 years ago. From that image, of her as a 20 year old, and then we make backwards, lowering the age to 15 years old. We have the age photo effect, and this looks like she could be a 50 year old, 15 year old version of our character. More remixing to bring her down to 10 year, years old. I also changed the pop from woman to kid, but kid is a slight problem potentially since it's gender neutral. With mid journey, you might want to specify girl or boy depending on your character. Here's our five-year-old. I use the word child along with five-year-old girl. I think this is a very good image of a five-year-old girl that could potentially grow up to look like our woman of older, older years. Using the word toddler and one-year-old girl. Be careful about your choice of words. If you are a parent, you will know that a one-year-old is not a baby, but a toddler. Baby girl, one month old. This is a nice photograph. But you know, the things about babies, you don't know how they're going to look when they're older. And a lot of them just look alike when they're like a month old. At this point, I started to think about the character's age and what would have been the, the pivotal moments in her life as she grew older. That might be helpful in styling the background environment of your character and even the appearance of your character based on hairstyles of the time. So if our 80-year-old woman in 2002 
That means she was born in 1942. I went back to the portrait of our 15-year-old girl. The year would have been 1957. A girl, a girl that age would be listening to Elvis Presley. My mom was that age. I remix this photo. Black and white photograph of an ethereal teen, 15 years old with short, wavy brown hair, listening to Elvis Presley on the radio in her bedroom in 1957. Aspect ratio, 3 to 2. The hairstyle is appropriate, and the back bedroom background matches the era. Women of that generation often got married young and had a family, or they became adventurous. It's easy to forget that many of the old people we see now were hippies in the 1960s. Woodstock happened in 1969. Our character would have been 27 years old. Here she she is at Woodstock in 1969 at the age of 27. It's hard to tell with the hairstyle if it resembles the same person all that much. But in real life, people often age very differently. And in this series, I did not experiment with changing the person's weight. People often get heavier as they get older, and that changes our faces. If she was at Woodstock, she still listens to rock music at 70. Let's remix our 70-year-old character with this pomp. Front row, a walk concert, happy, exuberant, dynamic motion, energetic. Here she is having fun in the front row. The older I get, I realize that 70 is not that old. May we all be fortunate to be dancing and enjoying life at 70.